Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of So Not Scary. In today's episode, we're going to talk about how to replace the mini sewing machine tension screw if it has fallen out. So let's see how we do that. I'm going to begin by preparing the machine for opening up. So the usual things I'll remove the plate cover, the bobbin, the battery compartment, okay? Um, and then start opening the machine. But before we do that, here's a question for you. Do you currently use a mini sewing machine? Yes or no? So comment down below, let me know whether you currently use a mini sewing machine or if not, what sewing machine do you use? Comment down below and let me know. Let's move on. So I've just removed the entire assembly which creates the thread tension setup around here and if I flip the front over on the back of it you will see that in there there is a little nut okay now in my machine that nut is firmly seated in place I don't know how maybe they've glued it in there but in a number of machines, this nut can actually just fall out. Essentially, this is a nut and bolt system. So this is the long bolt and this bolt then screws into that nut. So if your thread tension screw has come out, all you have to do is simply re-screw it back on the other side of this little nut. Okay, making sure that the nut is nestled or sitting really well inside this plastic hole. So the concave or shiny end of one plate is first going to go in. Make sure that that little pin pokes out through the hole, okay? Now I'm going to sandwich this bit on. Now, if you look at the screw, okay, it's wider on one end and narrower on the other. And I'm thinking the wider end is going to go on the bottom. There we go. Here we go. There you go. Okay. Now I've tried to get this nut out from my machine, but it's not coming out easily. But if it did fall out on yours, just simply make sure that you're holding the nut inside this plastic hole as you screw the bolt from the other side and you should be fine. I hope this was helpful. See you next time. Bye.